Many Catholics go to church on Sundays and receive the Eucharist. What is the Eucharist? What is that to me? We'd like to share with you our personal experience with the Eucharist. For me, the Eucharist is the tangible presence of Jesus. He invites me to welcome this presence in its totality. However, I have not always seen it this way. For a long time, I felt unworthy to fully receive Christ because I have neglected Him by making myself busy with chasing worldly satisfaction such as work, money, and entertainment while feeling unworthy. I still felt drawn to come to the Eucharist. When I made the decision to come, I experienced the freedom to let go of all the worldly distractions, especially the entertainment that doesn't bring lasting joy. Only Jesus can provide this true and lasting joy. His presence makes me feel alive. I now choose to spend time with Christ in prayer, adoration, and the Mass. My eyes are now set on Him and no longer on what this temporary world could offer. I could not see the beauty of the Eucharist because I believe in many lies. I saw myself as a person full of sin and I could not be with God who is holy and sinless. I thought of myself as unworthy. Seeing myself as unworthy is a sin in itself because God does not call me that. When I drew near to Jesus, I became aware that He calls me to forgive myself as He has already forgiven me. The sacrament of confession freed me from the bondage of lies. Now I can see God for who He is and who I am in Him. I began to see the beauty of the Eucharist. I desire to receive the Eucharist. The Eucharist is my source of restoration. It wasn't always like this. I used to force myself to live a perfect life, make no mistakes, and thought that only then I could be worthy to receive the Eucharist. When I did something wrong, I would put myself down and see myself as not good enough. These thoughts brought a lot of rejection. Then, I heard a teaching about Jesus being broken and shed His body for us during Mass. This act touches me because as broken as my life is, Jesus invites me to share my brokenness with Him. The next time at Mass, I could feel God inviting me to see my life like the host the bread that become his body. Though the host was broken, the value remains the same. The host is still holy. So is my life. Even though I am broken, God loves me the same and he calls me beloved. When I believe this, I am restored to the truth. During the MCO, we met together every Sunday as a community to share how the Gospel spoke to us in our lives today. Although we were unable to receive the Eucharist during this time, we were able to be in communion with one another, sharing our joys and struggles. We became the bread of life to one another as we encouraged each other on the journey, being a companion to each other in our fear and loneliness due to the pandemic and supported everyone in prayer. What was stirred as you listened to these stories? How do you see the Eucharist now? <laughs>